Okay, Amanda and me for sure. Going into game number one, we got Ape it Man's Rob versus Frog's Bayo. Uh, let's see if Ape it Man's got something going for him. Um, I think a big part of it is he's gonna have to. He needs a lot of grabs. You you have, Yo. if you want to beat Frog, you need to constantly punish Frog with grabs and make him second guess his approach to you. That way you can line things up better with your short hop aerials. But otherwise, it's it's gonna it'll be a little bit rough. Here we go. But real quick chat. Don't give Vance too hard of a time, man. It, it, it's, it's, been, it's been an interesting night. Well, I mean, <laughs> all right, chat. Where do French Spirits come from? Ask Vance. I gotta do it at least. No. I gotta do it at least once a week, man. Gotta do it at least once a week. <laughs> I'm gonna get I'm gonna get banned from being able to cast out of here. <laughs> anyway, right now, Frog taking a fit man to the skies as we are wont to do. Rashido <laughs> just followed him all the way up there, and that is one of the issues, man. When you're getting stuck in Bayo combos, it's so easy to get followed. Did he just remove? He just removed my picture. Yes, he did. <laughs> No, he removed yours. He put Vance there. Oh, what? <laughs> what oh, my God. <laughs> anyway, right now, uh, Frog just in prime position here. But even man not letting Frog just uh, completely slip away and, and uh, stall this one out. Oh, big oh. up smash. Yeah, what? bad landing by Frog. That was just a little unfortunate. That's one of the go-tos. That's one of the go-tos for uh, uh, for Rob to deal with anybody like that. The up smash out of shield, especially for Ape Man. I didn't get dealt with. It was Afro. It was an accident. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I took my boy out. I didn't mean to. <laughs> Friendly fire, man. What can you do about it? Oh, basically, what just Chira. happened was if we're in a zombie apocalypse, I basically just revealed that I would be okay with like putting you in front. And that's not cool. I didn't want that to happen. <laughs> oh. Oh, what a little dash grab there. I always feel like Rob's up smash will like automatically scoop and protect him all the way from both sides. That's not yep. true. He has a very interesting thing he does with that up smash too. He'll get a certain like hitbox that'll put you in into like this weird shuffle. I mean not the shuffle, this weird hit stun and then confirms into up air. Uh up air also something that can get bats within too. So I think that's a big reason why you're seeing a whole lot more attempted up smash KOs on when Frog wants to go airborne, uh, yeah, and it can also be witch timed as well. <laughs> Ajax, Malik, no Nostradamus here with that call. Jesus, what <laughs> kill confirmed from Frog right there. Hey, all I'm saying is that when I look at this matchup, I'm thinking Darwin, and uh, Rob is usually not one that's going to be continuing in this post-execution, so, or evolution. But, I mean, hey, Ape Man is such a smart player, right? Ape Man constantly gets to these points. He understands bad matchups, and he knows how to deal with it. And all the shots I keep throwing about this matchup, he gets it. This is somebody who's been playing Rob forever. And oh. that's that witch time on Gyro I was talking about before. That yeah. can get Ape Man if he decided maybe to get aggressive off the platform or off the ledge, and it would have just forced him into a free punish. Um, oh, wow. I was surprised Frog kept holding on to the gyro for so long. I'm so surprised Frog made it back. I'm not going to lie. Oh. I thought he was definitely going to get caught by that <laughs> down air. There's that, I, I, there I is that throw KO. Would, if Frog was holding on to the gyro for that situation to like get some kind of like immediate like uh, punish on uh, bad space Rob, and didn't mm -hmm. matter because Ape Man was able to swing. So. Exactly. Big. Oh yeah, but Ape Man trying to find trying to find those openings. Oh, and look at that, just short hop. It is Golden Corral post COVID, and Frog's trying to eat. Like it is just so easy to set up that play, get that combo going for just existing as Rob. You gotta watch your height. So Goodbye. Oh. See, that was more. I don't know if Ape Man didn't realize that the previous move struck, and that. Frog was no no longer in hit stun. Like that that felt like Ape Man was just mashing the gyro release <coughs> and mm -hmm. just was like, Oh, I'm I'm sure I'll get the follow up and Frog was nowhere even remotely near that gyro. Yeah, I mean, oh my god. I I, I, I agree, just put these Rainbow references out of there. Look, honestly, some <laughs> it like I've I've been I've been casting for like seven years or so now, and for the longest time I was just only focusing on like analytics, and I would just leave my jokes off. And for some reason it just kind of hit. Like it's all it's just improv hour. We're just being stupid. For, <laughs> it, it's a weekly. We're having a good time. Uh, but like I am. Look, man. I, I I will say, I applaud the the confidence in going back into this because. Right. It, it is you have to learn how to deal with this right like a bad matchup is something you're always gonna have to figure out if you want to continue to be like a really strong solo main or a character specialist and rob obviously falling out of that category in this game because he's significantly better 
But Ape Man's been at it for a long time with this character. And he yeah. wants to figure out how to beat this matchup. He's got to continue to push it. Even if you take the L's, you got to figure it out. But you gotta just be a little concerned about Ape Man's mentality if he was to drop this one because it's kind of like, you know he has the pocket Diddy. Mm -hmm. So far, it's all fraud right now here in game two. Oh, there you go. Finally getting a grab punish. Only a forward air is really much gonna come out of that because of exactly that. I didn't even get to say it yet. Up B is so quick. Uh, you don't get grounded off a low percent yeah. off the, sh the the throw. So you actually have to wait for them to swing first before you do anything after. Yeah, good thing he didn't move. He just covered it with the laser. He's like, I know you're going to do something with that gyro. If and now, just circling a little bit off, off stage. Oh, that was a weird... Oh, wow. Okay, that was a strange interaction. Oh, actually... Oh, I like that. Oh, yeah, it was beautiful. Break that down real quick. You put the laser out there, right? You force the jump, and then you also throw the gyro out there. You make him force a high recovery, and then he just eats the ABK. That was great conditioning for Maven Man. Also, the, oh, the frog just immediately responding and sending Ape Man this time. I just want to say that in that first stock take that uh, Ape Man got, the fair was really important because he, could, he was basically trying to see if frog was going to uh, batch within it. And so he was like, right, cool, fair mm -hmm. up air. But right now, going up in the air is Ape Man. My God. Yeah, and this, <laughs> look, something crazy about this matchup it, with how, like, how unusual it is for getting KOs with the up airs from Bales nowadays. The fact that Bale can consistently go, oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. This is bad. I don't think he has Brock. a jump. I don't think he has a jump. Yeah, he's oh. done. That was great coverage from Ape Man again. Yeah. Exactly. I had the same, same thought, Rejax. But, man, Frog's not, not going to let that uh, discourage him from just going back and giving Ape Man the hands. Yeah, because, you know, pretty much, oh, speaking of trying to give the hands, right? That's <laughs> cute. <laughs> that, that was funny. The whole sequence of both players being just slightly short in their punish attempts. Oh, Ape Man's starting to figure out how he likes to behave at a disadvantage. He's catching on some of these air dodges and witch times. Like, all right, I'm just going to grab that. Like, no point in swinging at that. I'm going to stock up. You got to be the one to swing at me. So I know you're looking hard oh, for a hit, so like an option. He wanted the roll in so badly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 the jump call. He's forced to ABK here. He's got to. Yeah, you have to get that right. And he gets by. I thought the down air was going to be free, but Frog avoids it. Frog escaped that circumstance too. Ape Man was looking to just nail him with the down air. Big laser that, though. Ape Man still living. Yeah, that laser came in clutch there. Oh, oh what yeah. a risky air dodge. He's, oh, that might be it. Ooh, no! Wow, I'm, I'm surprised it didn't KO. I, I straight up believe that was it right there. Ape Man did everything he could to get Frog to hold shield on get up to get that throw. That side B gets checked. It doesn't get. Oh, loses the trade. Get up attack's gonna beat it out though. This is looking. This is basically Ape Man's game to lose right now. He's one throw away from winning it. Uh, looking for something there. It did not work. Ape Man just caught out of out of, out of sync there. Maybe he just took a couple moments to get synced up with his robot. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> he currently stuck in a. When you try to avoid oh, the update forever, good. but eventually the update comes through and just makes your night of living nightmare. <laughs> that was a terrible closeout for what I tried to say, but either way, the up there is going to take it. All okay, I'm saying like, is I cannot stand was... when I avoid updates on my phone for 10,000 years and then it finally decides to do it when I need my phone the most. <laughs> it's less corny than what I was going to say, which was yeah, he, he stood around there while trying to download the actually <laughs> killing up throw, which worked. To, oh my uh, god! Pure game two and eight bit man, evening things up at one all. Yeah. So who was it before? See, Rainbow Star. Occasionally we could get the really good ones out, and then every, every once in a while we drop the bag real hard. So, <laughs> <laughs> but, but it's okay. You gotta be willing to laugh at yourself. That's the big thing. And WrestleMania so, showing up its head for sure in this next one. That Tombstone Pile Driver. Um, I heard that. I heard Raw was was terrible. I haven't watched wrestling in forever, oh, but man. I heard the follow up was pretty bad. I'll, I'll have to go check the, what the dirt sheets say after after. <laughs> All I know is Adamus was not happy on Twitter oh, today. No. <laughs> Alright, getting into the next game here. Running it into game number three. No stage switch. I don't really think that you need to. No. Um, a smaller stage only benefits Rob, so you don't want to go there in this matchup. Because it just makes it easier for Rob to punish you for behaving like erratically. And here, you got plenty of room to reset for both. That thing's off simple. Oh, that's where you don't want to be. <laughs> but luckily, wow. which twist Frog exists? Was, Frog was able to escape that. I, often, just when you're caught between Rob and Gyro, it's like, oh, you can almost just count stock loss. 
Yeah, pretty much. You take so much damage. It's such a, usually such a free situation, but having that escape option is just so good. The, the Apex Man's defense has actually been pretty on point. Like, that first game was, like, a little sus, right? He was trying to figure yeah. out Frog. But since then, he's kind of gotten, like, m significantly better at recognizing when Frog wants to actually swing. Oh, now we're starting to see the up tilt coming this way. Ah, just for a, for a brief moment. Frog's like, nah, I'm just gonna get back to my usual uh, you know, punish games. Pretty much, yeah. I'm actually like, it was actually funny that Frog answered right back after that. Because even though Ape Man's doing a good job of kind of avoiding it, Bayonetta in this matchup just needs to win Nooch twice. It just gets you to KO percents. It gets you with the snipe of the guns off stage. Everything was in Ape Man's favor. And the up B stopped the up smash punish too. Man, what if you were playing your favorite game and Bayonetta just went pew pew? That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I, I, I was trying to think of something funny, but I couldn't get anything off that there. But... <laughs> I do have a way with words. Right now, Ape Man is trying to have a way with pressure, but again, these up smashes keep getting interrupted, Ajax. He yeah, can't that, get it out. That, 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 that's a controller break moment for me, not gonna lie. Like, just yeah. when you're sitting there, hard, like, you, you recognize the punish, they went above you, and then you, can't, you keep getting beat out by the multi hit. You're losing a whole KO option in that. Back there won't take it yet, but. You're gonna get pressured at the ledge again. You gotta make the right choice. Ape Man coming in hard and swinging. Nice escape. Uh -oh. After oh, but Frog gets denied the down air. And Ape Man with that grab to clean up. Get the upper kill. Yep, keeping himself safe at the ledge, staying off stage. Usually don't want, you wanna not give up stage positioning for free, but you put the gyro out there, it makes Frog not be able to just kind of stare you down. Oh, get some caught between the gyro dude. That was a solid punish. What was that capitalization? I've never seen that before. That, Man, I'm telling you, like, oh. Rob is like watching somebody at Build-A-Bear shop. Just they straight yeah. up makes up things on the fly. We can't really make up anything to do with that back air as Ape Man's helplessly sent to the blast zone. Now down to his last stock here in game three. Yeah, now we're sitting there at a spot where it's much more like stressful. You you don't get to just kind of challenge her in the way you were doing before. Frog is playing with all the confidence in the world right now. Almost snipes your air dodge on the way down. See, Frog's a really bad dance partner because he's just not letting Ape Man get his feet under him. Look at this. It's an air dodge completely out of the way. Oh, yeah, this is a tango. For it's a tango for two, and Frog's currently on the floor go, dropping a solo. Oh, watch yourself! No. And load him all the way up there! Oh my god! Who the, who the hell you think you're hiding from? I hear you in the back of the room! What you think you're doing? Making it easy. Ape gonna try and stall his way out in the t upper blast zone area, and Bayonetta was like, Hello there! And just, <laughs> just took oh him out. Oh my god. Jesus. Ape of Man stalling, doing just everything he could to just try and sneak in the back of the house being out a little bit too late that mom heard you on the way in just pulled out the belt like, there was nothing at all he could do to escape <laughs> that oh crap this is just so nuts so now you gotta ask yourself you, you know ape man took a game managed to stay ahead and then that last game I, I just, it felt like Frog completely just avalanched him. Uh, I think a lot of it had to do with just the fact that Frog just kept dodging the KO options, right? Like, every time that Frog was going to get punished by an up smash, it just got wrecked. Also, thank you, Hammer Bro, for that. Really appreciate that. Oh, th yeah, thank you. Jeez, that's such a nice compliment. Um, yeah, we, we talked oh, to Chad okay. on my, I was, was going to speculate, are we going to see the Diddy, but nope. Does not look like it. Yeah, I'm I'm still very surprised. Like, and, and yes, that that is true. This is one of Rob's worst matchups, uh, like along with ZSS, uh, Pika, Game Watch stuff. But as a character specialist, you do you get into this mindset of okay, I, I, sometimes like you just want to learn. Like sometimes it's not necessarily about getting the dub; it's about learning something that you're struggling with. And if you continue to run away with it with a character that you don't feel 100% confident with compared to your main, sometimes it's worth it. Now holding you know 56 percent for just trying to exist at the ledge not necessarily a fun time but it's uh oh man and ape man just did just I mean, enough knockback to nudge him out of being able to respond and look at this oh my Rock, god no I, you know no, what? no 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 I, oh. maybe i'm gonna take away what i said this man has been unchecked 115 uh, percent oh maybe it's not the, maybe oh it's not the time god. to try to figure the match up out frog the oh my god demolishing that stock <laughs> yeah ape, ape man take a second <laughs> We said that the onset of this of this set, that Bayo can use Witch Time to make Rob pay for relying on up air. 
And that was it. Oh, you know what? Ape Man's a paid actor. He's trying really hard to just get Bayonetta to look really busted so he can get another, <laughs> like, just just get some more nerfs on her. That's it. That, I, that, that, that That's what it is. <laughs> We're going the conspiracy route. Okay, cool. I guess we can be. We can. Uh, we can be hey, hey, look, there ain't no. Uh, aren't you guys in Cali? Aren't you guys near Hollywood? This doesn't sound like it's off the script. <laughs> <laughs> right now, though, fraud just, just no fear. Even just taking that back air from Ape Man is really not going to change the way things are going so far. Look, now Ape Man's back off stage. Yeah, finds the aggressive upper. I like it. You're just kind of a just an option to kind of see if they're going to behave properly at the ledge. Ab oh my god, ABK is such a good burst option. Actually, at any time, the parry is going to save his life because that's a fresh down air with Rage. That could have possibly KO'd even with Rob's weight. I guess, oh, ab going for the full charge gyro. Okay, well, I mean, if he was trying to set up another uh, kill punch, <coughs> they taking the stock there. I, I applaud Ape Man for, for going for that stall again. Then we learned our lesson last time. This man hunted you down to the skies oh, just no. like that again. <laughs> Even find the right moment to jump out of that, just barely. Yeah, he did. Oh my oh. God! Confirms him to the back air too. This is the what we got. Two games up on Ape Man right now. Ape Man needs a miracle. Like this is Ape Man's tournament stock, man. Pray you to your to favorite deity down. and start like just think think of whatever anime you can and how they cheat the system and just start thinking of how you can cheat the system right now because Bayonetta is destroying everything you're trying to do and it just comes down to that that's just how this matchup gets at some points just you can't no matter what I'm you just, do you're checked i'm just so used to rob just being able to pull over opponents and advantage state and every time frog gets hit it's just like he gets back it's back up and starts swinging oh. but oh hey hey two disguise <laughs> hey, you know <laughs> the mechanic do it too <laughs> hey the mechanical buddy coming in for in favor of the robotic operating buddy <laughs> the, the flying the flying uh lawnmower was able to help out rob for a second it's a little too late we don't know yet it is possible look rob can cheat that's something you can never forget rob has side b so there's always the opportunity for ape man to just de like steal the game he just needs to put frog in that position here we go. Oh, hang on. Up there again. Believers in chat, anybody who still has hope here? I mean, he's brought it with 48. Frog waits out. Oh, oh hold up. He's oh. taking no damage. Ape Man is uh, dead. Oh, All right, never mind. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Oh, oh. All right. <laughs> I was getting, man, I was getting so into that too. I was, I was, yeah. I, was hoping, I was hoping for the comeback. I'm always for it. I, I love when people like just take anything that I'm saying and just kind of throw it in the trash. Because if you could just change the momentum of the